So maybe some of you who wants to learn the basic of SwiftUI wonders how to implement working SwiftUI in a simple app. Luckily, we already created the simple working counter app. I am new to SwiftUI and to me, making this counter app is absolutely easy. So the very first template for SwiftUI is a simple text. Let's modify the text attribute. Let's modify the text with font of system font with size 68. Next is we want to make a count button based on the design right here. Let's move to the Xcode. To add a button inside a body, adding another button will not work. This is because SwiftUI wants us to have a stack view block. Since the button will be below the stacks, let's use vertical stack or V stack and put those stacks and button inside the V stack. And I'm going to add a little bit adjustment here. Run and see the changes. Great, it is all correct. Let's redesign the button here by adding a frame of width 113 and height of 50 and with the center alignment. Let's add an overlay by adding a rounded corner rectangle with a blue color and add 8 points as the corner radius. Since the text is not visible to us right now, we need to recolor the text. Run and see the changes. Great, it is all correct. Now we want to add another button, which is a reset button. So what we need is by placing the reset button on the left of the count button. This means horizontally. We need to put those buttons inside a horizontal stack or H stack with an appropriate spacing. Let's copy and paste the button and design a little bit. So let's try to run and see on the simulator. Here, we have exact same layout. Notice when we tap the button, it's printing something, but still not a working app. We need to add the logic for counter. It's a quite messy here, so let's do refactoring. We can wrap this text creation into a function. Since the button is a little bit messy, let's wrap the button creation in a function and call it. To make it more readable, we can make our code can be read from the top to bottom. Great, it is more clear now. To do the counter logic, we need a variable to hold the current counter number, then update the text. In SwiftUI, this is can be easily done using a property wrapper named addState. This is a special property that can kind of bind the value of the UI instantly. So, when we modify the value of the counter, the UI gets updated automatically. When the count button tapped, let's add the counter by 1. And when the reset button got tapped, let's change the counter value back to 0. Last, we need to tell the text to display the counter value. Just as simple as that, no need to update the UI. Let's build and run and see the changes. Now, we can increment the counter and reset the counter back to zero. So this is how we implement simple counter app in SwiftUI. I personally am amazed with SwiftUI because it is really easy to learn and implement the UI. I am very excited to learn more about SwiftUI and hopefully I can share it with you in a simple way. So thank you for watching and see you in the next video.